New numbers show knocking down that gem may cost a whole lot more than fixing it up. For years, people have talked about tearing down the old Cass County Courthouse. Now, one group says it has proof it's worth saving. WSBT's James Spillmore is here. And James, that courthouse is certainly a big piece of history, but some think it just needs too much work. And Jennifer, that's why the Cass County Board of Commissioners put together a committee to find out the real cost of it. They found demolishing the building would cost around a million, but preserving it would come out to about $275,000. The former Cass County Courthouse was built in 1899. It's been closed for almost a decade, and now the county has a new courthouse. But some believe it's important to preserve a piece of Cass County history. They don't build buildings like this anymore, and once they're gone, they're gone. And unfortunately, uh, we as a society tend to tear things down a little too quickly. Mike Moroz is part of the group that's trying to save the former courthouse. He thinks turning the building into a multi-use facility will give it new life and stimulate the local economy. It could be used as a county museum. Uh, we've had a lot of advocates for that. Uh, cultural center, uh, that idea came up. Um, it could be used also as a wedding chapel. If preserving the building becomes a reality, the money would help pay for a new roof and improvements to the heating and lighting systems. A big chunk of the money would need to be used to clean up mold, which some say will only get worse the longer it sits with no decision. As for the cost, County Commissioner Bernie Williamson doesn't want taxpayers to panic. Obviously, everyone looks at grants. We're going to look at them as well, even though they haven't been available. We'll consider them. There's private donations, there's public donations, there are fundraisers. Critics aren't sold on the financial benefit of preserving the courthouse, but many in the community hope to see the old courthouse live for another 114 years. County commissioners stress that this is just in the beginning stages and that people in the community will have a chance to tell them what they think of it. In the studio, I'm James Fillmore, WSBT Channel 22 News.